elongation of the chain of amino acids occurs when peptide bonds unite amino acids brought to the ribosome by the tRNAs. The amino acid from the P site is transferred to the tRNA in the A site. The tRNA from the P site can then float away. The ribosome then moves so that the tRNA which was in the A site is now in the P site with two amino acids attached to it. And now a third amino acid can uh, approach the ribosome and join the now empty A site. At which point the two amino acids from the P site are attached to the amino acid in the A site and the cycle repeats itself. This cycle will continue until a stop codon, which has no corresponding tRNA, is reached, at which point proteins will dissociate the peptide chain from the final tRNA, and a peptide chain has been made whose amino acid sequence was specified by the codons of the mRNA, which were ultimately copied from the DNA.